I'm back, 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 back again. Hey guys, it's Girl Debris and the spot was hot, was cool. And welcome to another wonderful day here at Miller Intermediate. Today is Thursday, January 30th, and a B4 for health. Our delicious lunch for today will be chili cheese nachos, refried beans, steamed corn, salsa cup, raisins, and of course, milk. Now for a weather update. <laughs> Today's high is fit is 59 and the low is 49 with a 20% chance of rain and 74 for her humidity. Now to our wonderful principal, Mr. Stewart. Thank you, Jabrian. Good morning, everyone. How is everyone doing on this terrific Thursday? Hope you all having a great Thursday because guess what? Tomorrow is Friday, right? Okay, so Mavericks, let's look at our attendance for yesterday, fifth grade. Uh, you know what, boys and girls? I need to update my attendance. So I'm going to have to get back to you with that. I am so sorry. So, so, so sorry about that. But I will update you on our attendance for tomorrow. Okay? My apologies. However, please remember our attendance competition that goes through February 7th. Okay, homeroom classes with an average attendance rate of 98% or higher will receive a hamburger sandwich. So make sure that you're here every day. Your attendance counts. And guess what? Your DCA number two is coming up very, very shortly, only about two more weeks, and you'll be taking your DCA number two test. So you need to be spending the time here every day, getting prepared and getting ready so that you can achieve. Okay, remember that's the goal. All right, and our attendance goal is always 98%. Do not forget. All right. Again, I like I said, I'm going to remind you every day. Remember, if you see something, say, say something. something. You can, guys. You can chime in also. If you see something, say, say something. something. If you hear something, say, say something. something. All right. There we go. Staff also want to remind you that the Cognito training is today during your technology planning time in Mrs. Wash's office, where I'm sitting right now. Laptops and snacks will be available. All right, so please come on down and uh, complete that training. Remember, it's a required training for everyone, including myself, and it must be completed by February 10th. All right. Boys and girls, progress reports go home today. Make sure that you're looking keenly at your grades and knowing where you are and what you need to do in order to improve those grades. Okay, if you're not at that point where that, it, that your grade is satisfactory, you need to be looking carefully at those grades and inspecting that, looking at your goals for this year. Remember I told you that you need to be setting goals and you should have set them already for the second semester. Okay, so make sure that you're looking and knowing what you need to do to move up and grow. All right, because that's the goal, student growth. Fifth grade, you'll be taking a math CCA number six today. Hope you're prepared for that. And Avid t-shirts, they are still on sale, $15. So if you are in need of an Avid shirt, come on down to Ms. Cho's office and purchase a shirt. That's for staff as well. Chair practice is at 4 today. Dance practice is at 4.20 today. So cheerleaders and dance team members, make sure that you have uh, prepared for that and you have communicated that with your parents so that you can be picked up on time. All right. And also, sixth grade volleyball tryouts. Your time is today at 5.30. Remember, you pick up in the back or drop off in the back, if I would say. And make sure that you have a copy of your report card and a change of clothes so that you can work out um, in, a, in, an, in an appropriate way. Okay? All right. Now, I have some guests with me this morning. Hey, guys. How are y'all doing? Can you move the camera over there just for a minute? How are y'all doing today? Good. All right. You can put it back on me, Ferian. All right. So they're here visiting with me today because of what they accomplished yesterday. All right. So what you just saw, who you just saw, I should say, is our district STEM fair winners. So congratulations to our district STEM fair winners. Good job, guys. Good job. Okay. Now, if you, if you look carefully, you'll notice that they have medals around their necks. Yes, they won medals yesterday for their, um, their projects that they created and presented. All right. And I'm going to go down the list here. I have um, Ivana Escoto placed ninth place with her project Safe Plate. Congratulations. Good job. Good job, Ivana. 
Okay, we have Layla Valencia. She got sixth place with her project Zip Bands. Congratulations, good job. Awesome, Honora Stout with her project Adjustable. Awesome job, Honora. Good job. And Mr. Ryan Wynn, hmm, Ryan, you're a popular man these days, aren't you? All right, good job though, good job. He placed fifth with his project Bird Bottle Theater. Awesome job, Ryan, good job. And last but not least, we have our fourth place winner with, um, who is um, Adenike O with Light Intensity Control. Awesome, awesome. All right, guys, um, you know we always encourage students to venture into science and engineering, especially girls. And notice who we have here today. We have one, two, three, four, and only one male student, okay? We have always been encouraging, yay, yay for that. I see Miss Chopper in the background. And also, Miller Mavericks, not to forget our sponsors, Miss Chopper and also Mr. Michael. Mr. Michael is not uh, here with us today, but I just want to make sure that um, I say, and Mr. Cavell, sorry about that, and Mr. Cavell as well. Okay, so I just want to make sure that I mention their name because they've worked really, really hard with these students to bring them and um, bring their projects to where they are today. All right, and as you can see, they've achieved a lot. So congratulations again, guys, and another round of applause for you. Awesome job. Awesome job. All right. Now, I guess we're going to move on to our birthday segment. And looking at my list, I only have one person celebrating a birthday today. Imagine that. All right, and let's see who that is. We have Miss Jacqueline Lollick from uh, Mr. Retook's class in fifth grade. Happy birthday! <laughs> Happy birthday. All right. Okay, it's always great to celebrate a birthday when it gets close to, what, Super Bowl weekend, right? Awesome, awesome. All right, I know you're going to celebrate that well. And to help you celebrate today, Jacqueline, we have our happy birthday song for you. Happy birthday to Happy you birthday to Happy you. birthday Whoa. to you Happy birthday to you Happy birthday to you Happy birthday to you All right, Miller Mavericks and staff, as usual, I wish you all a great and productive day today as I walk around the building, boys and girls. I need to see you focused on your work in the classroom, paying attention to the instruction, and getting your work done, okay? That's the key, making sure that you are learning and growing, all right? That's the goal, so make sure that you're paying attention, all right? And those of you fifth graders taking your math test today, good luck on that. Make sure that you're showing your work. That is very, very important. Show your work. I do not want to see folks just writing down answers or bubbling in answers, okay? You need to show the work. Remember what you have been taught. Show those models. Show the work, okay? All right. So with that, I wish everyone a great day, and I will see you around the building. Back to Jabria with Morning Movement. Time for Maverick's Morning Movement. Get out of your seats and on your feet. Let's get our blood pumping. Remember, exercise grows brain cells. Stay tuned for a guided exercise activity. Hashtag ABL. Good morning. Teaching bus 292 and 46 has not arrived yet. Bus 292 and 46 has not arrived yet. Hi, it's Sarah again, back with Morning Movement. <laughs> Today, we're going to switch it up from the things that we usually do and stretch our feet. Wow! One, two, three, five, <laughs> six, seven, eight, nine, ten. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance and for the Pledge <coughs> Texas flag. Please remain standing for a moment of silence and dress code check. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. 
Honor the Texas flag. I pledge allegiance to the Texas, one state under God, one and indivisible. All right, Miller Mavericks, now it's time for our Miller Intermediate Jessco check. Ladies, only dime size earrings. Be sure you are in your uniform shirt. Only plain white undershirts, only plain brown or plain black belts, navy or khaki pants, uniform coats and jackets, and be sure you have your ID or temporary ID on correctly. Now time for the Miller Pledge. As a Miller Maverick, I will make, make good choices, choices, involve myself responsibly, listen, learn all I can, excel beyond expectations, respect myself and others. And remember, after high school, comes college, and do what you can to ride with pride to go from good to great. Remember, who runs the world? Girls. <laughs> Ciao, adios. I'm done. Remember the thing as I just said.